to another exciting episode of the Talk Show Show. Today, we have an exciting man straight from the States. Give it up for world-renowned go golfer, Ms. Juna. Wait, I have a call. Yes? I'll be right there. Da -da 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 -da. your bare hands. <laughs> yes, I did in fact actually kill 12. And uh, <laughs> also around the field, bayonets warped by the heavy firing coming out of the muskets. And I killed them with the hand trowel that we used to dig the trenches. <laughs> I actually did. I felt remorse, and I couldn't help but think how part of me was dying with them. But then, I, after the war, I went out to Germany to find the uh, families of the members that I killed. And that's actually how I met my wife. <laughs> my wife, her last words were, learn golf and, and learn it well. And I, I kept true to that. I learned golf and I won at least 11 championships, all the trophies in my room. And, and then, but we had a daughter before she died and we sent her off to Germany with her grandparents because I became insane. <laughs> <laughs> helped you break through your sense of chronic depression and bipolarism. Well, <laughs> it was, it actually had to be my great friends. I mean, they, wow. I mean, they, they, they were also other golfers, you know, that's how we met in the golf. Yeah. And they, we learned about the absolute swing, which is the swing that you're born with and somehow they tied that into my chronic depression and bipolarism. <laughs> Anything else? Well, no. I was actually taught by someone. Who were you taught by? I don't, I don't want to say. <laughs> Can you please speak up? We want to know. It was a black guy, okay? I was taught by a black guy. <laughs> Uh, well, <laughs> that's, that's all the time we have. Thank you for joining us. <laughs> Thank you for having oh, wait, me. Wait, Arnold, what about all No, no, it didn't. Okay, Terry got What did you read and who <laughs> were you? <laughs> <laughs> what book did you read and who were you? Yeah, well, yeah, I'm asking that question. I was, uh, well, I read. Actually, I was in The Legends of Something Bannis, I can't remember. Oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> since the wee age of six or seven, I can't remember. I thought you didn't learn to golf until your wife told you to. <laughs> <laughs> and golf mode. Well, no, no. My, my <laughs> <laughs> You're not even a guy. Okay. <laughs> I started going pro because I was at like an amateur level. Didn't she tell you to learn golf? Oh. Learn <laughs> professional golf. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I kind of phrased it into, you know, it was actually like a last sentence or paragraph that she said to me. Professional golf. Oh, I think it's tight. 
Well, in the war, I met this black guy, and we were comrades, and he didn't him. No. And we both, we both were the f people that were fighting, but I killed most of them. I killed the people that were around us. And uh, so after we got back, I went into depression, and he was one of the great friends that were actually taught me about the absolute swing. And so, you know, he... He was really there, or you were saying that he was there? really there? Most likely. I thought, I, I, thought I saw him, at least. You know, it okay. was chaos, okay. flashing. <laughs> okay, I got it. No, you Yes. What happened to your daughter when she went to Germany? I actually live in Germany. I left the state. And. <laughs> so after my wife died, we sent her to live with her grandparents because, you know, of chronic depression, bipolar, and, you know, doesn't mix with the child. Do people think you're insane? <laughs> Do you remember uh, how the families reacted when you told them you killed their, uh, their family? Oh, that's, that's interesting because some of them slammed the door and called me names at the door. And others embraced me because, you know, it's so generous to go actually go over there and, you know, talk to them about, I'm oh, sorry I'm to kill their only child. And Wait. <laughs> Wait. Was that actually in the book? Yes, that was actually in the book I was in. Yes. <laughs> they really embraced you for yes, killing they, their they, only they, child? They saw it as an act of kindness that I would go over there and try to comfort them after killing their only, only child. child. In the war, right? In the war. Because, you know, they, they said I was so brave and valiant. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Is this like a real book or is it just a Yes, this is the book I was in. <laughs> <laughs> well, is that the fourth question? Is it fiction or non-fiction? <laughs> non-fiction is real, dude. Wait, which one's which? Non-fiction is real. Oh, wait, non-fiction. It's real? Non-fiction. Oh, wait. Fiction. 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 Yeah, the effort makes me help. Yeah. Fiction is me. Yep. Yeah. So, is that all the questions for me? Yes. Do people think you're insane? Just... Yeah. I have been called insane. Oh, Michael.